Researchers are constantly finding new animal species, but one has recently surprised by its unusual figure, as it is a fish that has a protuberance that resembles the mythical unicorn. Researchers stumbled across a bizarre species of blind cavefish with a mysterious, horn-like structure protruding from its head and a lack of scales or pigmentation. Lurking within the dark waters of Chinese caves is a bizarre fish species that has an uncanny resemblance with mythical equine creature. The newfound fish weirdos, which researchers discovered hiding in a pitch-black pool the size of a kitchen table, have no scales or color, tiny rudimentary eyes that likely cannot see anything and an unusually large horn jutting out of their foreheads, a new study reveals. The researchers found the drab, unicorn-like fish while surveying cavefish from the genus Sinocyclochelus. Fish in this genus are found only in China, usually within small pools that are shrouded in darkness. There are 76 known species of Sinocyclochelus, most of which share similar characteristics with the newfound species, such as reduced or no vision, a lack of scales and no pigmentation. However, only some Sinocyclochelus fish possess a horn, and others have lost their eyes completely in a process known as regressive evolution, in which species lose complex features over generations. There are also a handful of Sinocyclochelus species that live in illuminated waters and lack the unusual features associated with their freaky cousins. Researchers discovered the newfound fish swimming in a small pool measuring 5.9 feet, 1.8 meters, wide and 2.6 feet, 0.8 meters deep, inside a cave in the mountainous Guizhou province. The team collected individuals to take back to the lab and examine, unaware that they were collecting a never-before-seen species. After comparing the fish with other known species and analyzing their DNA, the researchers realized what they had uncovered. In the new study, published January 17 in the journal Zookeys, the team described the species, which they named S. longicornis. The fish are between 4.1 and 5.7 inches, 10.5 to 14.6 centimeters, long and possess two pairs of whisker-like barbels that they use to feel their way around in the dark. But perhaps their most interesting feature is their unusually long horn-like structure, which has no clear use, and isn't found in closely related species. The name Longicornis is derived from the Latin words longus, meaning long, and cornu, meaning horn of the forehead. These horn-like structures differ widely among dark-dwelling Sinocyclochelus species, they vary in length and can either be forked or non-forked, like in S. Longicornis. As light-dwelling species do not have horns, these appendages likely have something to do with living in the dark, but it is not clear what their purpose is, the researchers wrote in the paper. The most logical explanation would be that the horns help these fish to see in the dark, but their barbels already enable them to navigate around their pool, which is not very big so would likely require minimal navigation skills anyway. Most Sinocyclochelus species, including S. longicornis, also have a fully formed lateral line and organ made up of highly sensitive cells that runs laterally down a fish's body and detects changes in pressure, temperature and salinity so the horn is also unlikely to be needed to detect those. However, the unusual size of the horn on S. longicornis, coupled with the fact the new species is not closely related to other longhorn species, suggests that longhorns have emerged on at least two separate occasions in the genus, researchers wrote. Therefore, comparing the environmental conditions of S. longicornis with some of the other longhorn species could finally reveal what the mysterious structures are actually used for.